Hi, I'm Lizzie McNiffin and this is GW News. All you Tiger Woods fans will be delighted to hear that the 14-time major winner is getting ever closer to his return. As reported by Golf Channel's Tim Rosefort, the 38-year-old was hitting full shots at Medalist Golf Club, his home course in South Florida, last weekend. Woods now faces a race against time to make the Open Championship, which travels to Royal Liverpool this year, and the countdown is certainly on for the 17th of July. Rory McIlroy returns to his native Ireland this week for the Irish Open. Although he arrived at Fota Island with a wee bit of a problem, he's without his clubs. The world number six, who has never won his home open, saw his preparations disrupted after his golf bag was lost. An understandably annoyed Rory tweeted the airline in question to try and find where his clubs were, and they were eager to avoid the bad press, claiming that his bag would be waiting for him at the course later today. Now we're just three days removed from Martin Keimer's win at the US Open, but Pinehurst is preparing itself for the start of the women's equivalent, which starts tomorrow. Suzanne Pedersen, a two-time major winner, missed out on the first major of her season, the Craft Nabisco Championship, due to injury, and she's excited to take on the course just a week after the guys. It's not going to be an easy walk out there, even though you've watched all the guys uh, fail and succeed on their uh, strategies, but um, it's in great, great shape, and uh, it's only going to get tougher from here, I guess. So with the water they poured on it last night, and it drying up with a hot week, uh, it's going to be quite a ba quite a battle. That's all for today. Join us tomorrow as we continue to look ahead to Thursday's first rounds. In the meantime, you can follow us on Twitter at Golfing World TV, and we're on Facebook and Instagram too. Thanks for watching.